Let's finish up with Jacob's shop. The knife will open up this thingy. What on earth is that? It's just polish? It's shoe polish? Hmm. I'm not sure where the polish goes. Where does my instrument token go? I could have sworn it, it went somewhere here. I need a vice for that. I don't know. I'll use a hint. Hint says... There's nothing for me here. Okay. Yes, that's right. The instrument token goes over here. That gives us the vice. That's the thing I was missing. So the instrument token, it's used outside to give us the vice. The vice goes over here on the vice in order to get a fixed key. We're going to use the key to open up this. And now we can use all these items. Uh, the polish goes here. Steiner, thief and murderer. Jacob really doesn't like Steiner, and I, I don't think I can blame him once we figure out why. Okay, I'll tell you why. Steiner basically ran him out of business. <laughs> that's that's basically it. Okay, so uh, Vienna Music Code goes here. So we want to play all these things. One, two, three. This can be a complicated puzzle, so it's... Uh, one... Two... Three... And four and five... Now we're gonna play, uh, let's see, six, seven, eight. Now you can see it's six, seven, eight, that, it's like, this was the one we skipped, it's those ones next to it. Does that make sense? Okay, so, not for this, if this is, um, that, the one we need to press is over here, which is, uh, three keys left of it, and then two keys right of it, we're only focusing on the black keys in that particular case. Is that one? That's how you solve the puzzle. Okay, this gives me a pocket watch. Let's solve this puzzle. This puzzle should be easy to solve. You just rotate the rings until you have a picture of a man in a hat. A man who looks suspiciously like the Phantom. Right? That totally looks like the Phantom. We'll get her tonight! Ooh. Is Katharina still in danger? I... I thought we had saved her, but I guess we didn't. She's still in danger. Okay. Okay, so we have to go to the theater as, um, uh, wh whoa, who are you? Detective, my name is Gregory. I saw a man drawing the phantom sign on the mirror. I tried to stop him, but he attacked me and ran into Katharina's room. Then I heard her scream. Oh no! I'm sorry I'm not well enough to help, but this might help you open the door. So the phantom went after Katharina. Wow, this phantom keeps going after a bunch of people. Like, first I thought the phantom was going after Katharina, and then Air Steiner, and, and now, now the phantom's going after uh, Katharina again. Okay. I don't know, maybe the phantom's just attacking multiple people at once. <laughs> okay, so the phantom is definitely leaving a calling card for disasters. Let's see, I use the mirror here. Oh, oh no, she's unconscious. Okay, I use the mirror here. I'm gonna need something to pick that, pick that lock. Let's see, what am I missing here? I lift this up, aha, that's what I was missing. I lift this up to get a wire. I'm gonna undo the wire as a lock pick. Okay, Katharina, are you okay? Maybe I can help her. A watch will help me check her pulse. Okay, I have a watch. She is unconscious. Good, she's still alive. She's not actually dead. Let me double check. There are no morphing objects or collectibles in this room for us to find. Good, good, good. Let's solve this hidden objects challenge. So we need to fold this uh, in order to get the medical symbol. That's kind of cute. We need a bunch of pills. Lots and lots of pills. I need to finish this decoration. Okay, with green colored thread. Pocket watch. A peacock. Looks like I need a bandage and a thermometer and more and more pills. What's this? Ah, this is a puzzle. You want to move these things left and right in order to form a complete picture. I think uh, the two circles are going to go in the middle, obviously. Yep, the two circles go in the middle, so... And then the smaller pieces go on the ends. That's the easy way to uh, get that puzzle solved. 
all the pills and the bandage. Okay, I have a medical kit. Let's look through it. Oh no, this, it's, it's kind of broken right now. So let's take a look at this. Oh no, it's all melty and covered in stuff. So we're gonna melt it. We're gonna melt off the wax. That's one of the symbols for the medical kit. So let's put it here. Looks like we need another symbol. Is that the dress token? The dress token that I've been carrying around forever. It goes here. Okay, so it looks like it's dress, diamond, lipstick, and then pill. Dress, diamond, lipstick, and pill. That's what the picture shows. Smelling salts. That will wake her up. Oh, he came from out of nowhere. I must have fainted because I don't remember anything after that. I've been put in danger again because of Steiner's dirty deeds. I'm through with him. The folder has the evidence of his crimes. Here's the key. What? Steiner's dirty deeds. Well, I kind of want to take a look at this. Uh, yeah, let's take a look at this, and then I'll do some deductions about the room, okay? What's this dirty deeds by Steiner? Eh? This goes here. This is uh, clearly just a simple jigsaw puzzle. We're making a picture of a man. I don't think I've seen him before. Katarina, you won't triumph without my protection. Help me and I'll make you famous. If anything happens to me, I, Katharina, state that Aristiner is guilty of Sophia's death. I've got evidence in the locked room. Oh my, so Steiner was the one who killed Sophia. Steiner has been bribing city archivists to destroy documents, and Jacob lost his shop because of Steiner. This is actually Jacob. So, is Jacob the Phantom? He loved Sophia, and he wanted to get revenge on Steiner because Steiner took away his shop. So he's got lots of reason for um, wanting revenge. So let's see. This most recent attack, uh, attack, the culprit was unorganized, strange. Footprints, big handprint, not Katarina's. Fabric caught like breeze. The intruder didn't expect to find Katharina in here. There was a struggle, and she lost consciousness. So he had a chance to escape through the secret door. Judging by the draft, the tunnel leads to an exit. I must hurry. We'll have to find our way in there and find the Phantom. Unfortunately, the lever is broken. We will not be able to use the lever. So let's go back over here. And that's the lever. And Gregory, are you okay? Can we talk to him again? No, we're not going to talk to him again. Why would we want to talk to that guy again? He's just going to lie there forever. Okay, now let's go. Go chase after the Phantom. Okay. Such a little thing with sharp teeth probably hungry. Let's give it the pear in exchange for the knife. Let's see. We need an eagle's leg, and we need a wrench in order to fix that. There's the letter D. There's morphing objects. Looks like there are two morphing objects here. I think I found them both. Great. Okay, something sharp. We'll get this picture out. These are various uh, characters in the game. There's a brush. Too much rust. We need some acid, and we can't reach this. So we're going to have to use acid to clean this in order to get that picture. And let's see. What am I missing? Perhaps something up here. Aha! This is the exit. Uh, the exit gives us the eagle claw. And we're going to clean this. So the two symbols that make that. This and this? This and that. Haha! -ha! So that gives me the second of the circle, so I can continue chasing after the phantom. Okay, uh, all these all these pieces need to go together. So we need to figure out what order they go in, though. Because we have to move them around to get them all in the correct spots. This can be a little tricky. Those two don't really look like they work together. They, they kind of overlap and then kind of not. Yeah, that face looks like it goes there next to the purple one. The purple one is correct, unless I'm mistaken. Okay, so what face looks like it goes here? Who has an upper right part? Yeah, that face looks good. And 
then maybe these two? Hmm. There we go. Okay, that's it. Kind of a tricky puzzle, really hard to see what to do, but aha! It is Jacob. Jacob is just hiding around here. Jacob, what are you doing? Empty. The Phantom tricked me. I'm not the Phantom Detective. My name is Jacob. I own this music shop. At least, I did before that fat cat Steiner took everything. My documents were all burned, and I'm nobody without them. Here, see for yourself. A terrible fire destroyed the documents. Okay, once again, we need to find the items in red. So, a terrible fire destroyed all the dark documents at Pointer Street. In order to recover uh, the records, the residents need to prove they own the spots. Otherwise, Air Steiner gets everything. Oh no, that's not good. So after the fire, the Phantom told me about the secret passage at the theater. He said I'd find my document there, but he lied. If you find it, I'll help you find him. I thought it would be inside a violin, but I only found this. Hmm. Well, let's help Jacob find his ownership papers and prove that he actually owns his house and not Air Steiner. That would be the nice thing for us to do, correct? So let's see. There's a wrench. That's good. I needed a wrench. Let me just go back here and use my wrench. Use the wrench. Okay, that gives me a handle. Nice. I need a button to fix that. And here I need two plaques. I need two plaques there. So let's see. This goes over there. We want to move these things left and right in order to form a spigot. But I, I need uh, I need one more thing. Let's see. This looks like a piece of jewelry. The strange ring goes in there. Pulling it up, we've got another picture. And the spigot. Okay. So that goes there, giving us vinegar. We're going to go back one screen. We're going to use the vinegar here. Vinegar is acidic, giving us the final picture going to put the pictures on the wall here. So let's get all these characters correct. This, uh, let's see. Gosh. What you want to do is move the, the pictures according to um, their outline. So this is a big circular one. It goes in the big circular frame. This um, has a little narrow top, so it's the one with the narrow top. And then this apparently has a narrow bottom, so it's the one with the narrow bottom. And that's how we solve it. So those are pictures of uh, various characters. This gives me the button. Button which goes here. We're going to fill this up, giving myself the other name plaque. We're going to use both name plaques over here. So can we get all these countries correct? Hmm, I don't know. So let's see. Okay, I've got all the flags correct. That's good. That's good. London, uh, Munich, and Vienna. Whatever city this is, it's kind of blotted out, so you can't actually see it. So let's see, you can just do um, random guessing and hope to get it correct. Oh, worked perfectly well there. So the landmarks, those are all those landmarks. And let's see, Munich's row is all finished. This column is all finished. So it's like, um, London, London has tea, and Vienna has coffee. So once you get everything into place, uh, what do we get? Did I not solve the puzzle? <laughs> ah, that gives me this bottle over here to the right. Okay, what is that bottle? Well, it's got those grapes. Those grapes go over here on the outside, giving us a cork. And I think this cork has Jacob's papers. I mean, this this bottle has Jacob's documents inside. All right, we found that Jacob Sr. and Jacob Jr. own the music shop. Hooray, Jacob! Hooray, we found those papers.